Hello, this is a continuation of the how to fill multiple shapes with a photo tutorial. It is recommended that you have seen the first part. To view it, just click on this preview window. Today I'm going to show you how to move one of the hearts without disrupting the photo and place it somewhere else. To do that, we will use a clipping mask. First, let's duplicate this clip group layer. Just click on it to select it, hold and drag it to the create a new layer icon. And we've got another copy. If you would like, you can rename it. Let's name this one top and the other one bottom. With the top layer still selected, click on it and move it to the right. Let's change the opacity of the bottom layer to 20% so you can better see what we are doing. Next, choose one of the hearts that you like to separate from the artwork and we will draw a mask around it. I'm going to choose this heart on the bottom. First, press the letter P to switch to the pen tool and then draw a shape around this heart. Make sure you cover it completely. Now press the letter V to select it and while holding down the shift key, select the rest of the artwork. Next, either go to Object, Clipping Mask and choose Make or right click with your mouse and choose Make Clipping Mask. Now we can move this part, rotate it and place it wherever we like. Let's lock the layer with the heart, unlock the bottom layer and change its opacity back to 100%. Next, to make it look like this heart has been removed from the pattern, we will need to apply a clipping mask to the bottom layer. We will basically reverse the process of drawing our mask. First, select the pen tool and then draw a shape that will cover everything but the heart that we want to move. Now press the letter V to select this shape and while holding down the shift key, select the heart as well. And press the Ctrl and 7 keys on your keyboard to make a clipping mask. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.